All right. The gift of free will is what enables you to decide whatever you want. So that gift that God gave you can be exercised in such a way that you then believe you are not connected with God. Right? So you create separateness. Right? And it's very important to understand that in the beginning, God created us to be at one with God eventually. But God didn't automatically give that gift to you because then she would have been overcoming your free will. She wants you to make a free will choice to connect with her. You follow me? She doesn't want you to for she doesn't want to force herself or force her love on you. Is it love then? No. no. So God does not force her love on you. So there is no divine love in you at the time you incarnate. <coughs> so please understand that. There's a common fallacy today that we that people believe we all have the divine spark within us. That's one of the things I address today. You have a natural love spark within you, and if you want to receive a divine love in you, you need to ask for it. It's quite simple. And there's one the one reason why is because God's love is belongs to God, something outside of you, and it can enter you only if your free will is exercised. God always respects your free will. So that's the first thing to understand. Separateness is created by our desire to disconnect, firstly from ourselves, but also in the end from things around us. So as soon as you desire to disconnect from your emotion, you're at that moment desiring to disconnect from yourself, because your true self is your emotion, and you're desiring to disconnect from everyone around you, and you're desiring to connect, disconnect from God. As soon as you reconnect with your emotion, whatever that emotion is, and it could be that you're fuming angry, as soon as you start connecting to that emotion, you're now at least connecting with yourself. You might not be connecting with too other, many other people in that state, but at least with yourself, you're at least making the first step into this process of connecting with yourself, everyone, and, and God as well.